Look at them eating, enjoying their little snack. Something that I'll probably have to do pretty soon. Hello everyone and welcome to Wednesday. Uh, normally we eat pretty good. And, and I really do mean that. I feel like we generally make pretty uh, healthy choices about what to eat. And it doesn't always seem like that, I'm sure, to vlog viewers because we tend to show the more interesting and sometimes unhealthy foods that we eat on the vlog. We don't always show every single thing we eat, but the things that we don't show are usually the less interesting but healthy choices, like a protein and a vegetable. We do that a lot. Um, we also do a lot of salads. And today, for whatever reason, I suddenly became instantly sick of salad. And you have to understand, we've been doing salads for a long time. Like, at least like once or twice a week, uh, minimum, we will have a salad with usually some sort of protein with it, usually chicken or something like that. And uh, today for lunch, Mouse started pouring the, the lettuce onto the plate, and whenever I saw the lettuce, I was like, wait, don't even put mine on the plate. I don't know why, I just can't like stomach the idea of eating that today. And she was like, okay. So she had a salad. I actually had peaches. We uh, we got four peaches in here, and I ate two of them for uh, a very late lunch. And um, it was fine, but it's not going to be enough food. Although, to be fair, salad generally isn't either. One of the problems that Mal and I have is that, um, you know, we're both very different people, and um, calorically, how many calories we can consume are wildly different. Um, I need about twice as many or more calories in a day than Mal does. Um, so, especially on something that's as low-cal as a, uh, a salad, sometimes I'm left wanting. So sometimes I'll have a bigger salad or I'll have more protein on it or something like that to, um, to help fill me up. Uh, but often it's just I, I have to snack a little bit throughout the day. Um, it's probably going to be a little bit worse today because I didn't even have like a like a meal. I ate two peaches. And I'm not sure how well I'll do, but that might be resolved soon because Mao has got a dentist appointment today. How exciting! So we are going to leave here, head to the dentist appointment, and um, get that squared away, and then maybe afterwards I might get a sandwich. See you shortly. I'll be expecting you in the parking lot. Talk to you if otherwise. Okay. Uh, yes, could I have the four-piece chicken supreme combo? Okay, we're going for your dipper sauce. Uh, honey mustard, please. Yes, sir. Um, fries. I'll do fries and a sweet tea. And your drink? Uh, sweet tea, please. Okay, Luke, what's your order? Uh, yeah. Okay, so we have a sweet cream combo with honey mustard fries and sweet tea. It's hope you're better than now, of course, here in the window. All right, thank you. All right, thanks. Have a great day. You too. Living in Myrtle Beach is interesting because of driving situations like the one you saw. Come up to two stop signs. The person in front of me, uh, on the other side gets there first. I get there second. So I stop. They've stopped. They go. So it's my turn. The person behind them just rolls on through. And I deal with that a lot. There's some incompetency here, sure, but a lot of it's tourism. Like the person who ran that stop sign was from New York. And there's, it, a lot of times it's it's tourists, sometimes it's locals, but for the most part, driving here is easy going. And if you're from out of town, especially if you're from a place that's not so laid back and not, uh, and, and much more aggressive, you know, aggressive driving, which is not really the case here. I mean, everyone's just kind of laid back doing their thing. If you're from one of those places and you bring that mentality here, you're gonna cause some problems. Hi. Hey, welcome back. How Hi. was your teeth? 
Okay, feels good. He said he'd put a permanent filling on my root canal tooth, so I don't have to worry about that anymore. Oh, good. Um, and he said it's strange that it hurts, but he said that might make it help calm down so it doesn't hurt anymore. Um, and also there's a bubble in one of my other fillings because it's porcelain and they cure it. So there's like a bubble that they never fixed at the other place because they've never done a filling here. He goes, I can take care of that really easy. He's like, I'll take care of that when I do your root canal filling. It's nice to know that in contrast to my earlier slightly bad meal at Bojangles, we're having a good dinner, right? Yeah. And this is fairly healthy. I mean, it's probably packed with like sodium, but otherwise it's fairly healthy. You know, what's interesting is that um, before I shot this clip, I had to actually remind myself what happened today. You ever have those days where like one day becomes two? It's not actually two days, but the day goes on for so long that it feels like two days. It's not even that it's that late. It's just that there's occasions where, I don't know, like if you do a lot in a day. It happens a lot, I think, for us whenever we're on vacation because a lot of times we'll be doing a lot of stuff in one day and sometimes by the end of the day you think back to the events that happened at the beginning of the day and you're like that was yesterday right and other people are like no that was today that's what today felt like um because after we ate or after i ate that food and we came home um we've just been working and uh mal you've done great thanks you've really done great mal's working on a painting for banjo kazooie and uh she dumped eight hours a yep. little about eight hours maybe a little more into that painting today um which is gr great it's really great especially because as of tomorrow we've got one week until carly's here yeah. right mm -hmm. is it is it just a week mm -hmm. so um definitely now is the time <laughs> to really uh start pushing ahead but uh she did really good today um but she's also approaching this banjo kazooie painting whether you realize it or not yeah in a very detailed manner. Uh-huh. So you're gonna have to have some eight hour days in order to make sure that everything gets done before, uh, before your sister's here next week. Anyway, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna eat this food and try to uh, kind of counteract the effects of the fried chicken I had earlier. And as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?